everybody, Mac here. Welcome back to the show. Welcome to December 17th, day 17 of our Lego Advent, Lego City Advent calendar opening. December 17th, ticking down the days to Christmas. It is crazy to me that it is almost here. We're like eight days away, almost a week away. Tomorrow we will be a week away, I think. Yeah, tomorrow will be a week away from the big day. And um, this month has flown by. Thank you for joining me with this. Also, apologies that this uh, video is getting out a little later than usual. I was out finishing up my Christmas shopping tonight. Only one more thing. Only one more thing that I need. And then Mac will be finished. Looking forward to that. So, what do we have today? We have door number 17, which I just set up. So I'm not really sure where it's at. 16 was down here yesterday. Oh, 17 is also down below near the barn. So let's open this up. Let's see what we've got. And we have, hey, we have the tree. We have a tree. I don't know if this is the tree. Yeah, I think it is. I think it is. We got the Christmas tree today, which is cool. I was looking forward to that. Like I said the other day, some of these things have been very meh to me. So when we get something that's a that's a standard like this, the Christmas tree, and it looks like it's going to be bright and colorful, and it looks like it's going to sit well in the house right there, I'm happy when we get stuff like this. So let me open this up. Let's put this together, and we'll take a look at it. All right, so here we are. It's our little Christmas tree. Now, granted, this isn't one of the most grandiose Lego Christmas trees that we've seen before, especially when you compare it to something like this guy that came from the um, Santa's Visit set that we looked at at the beginning of the month but i do like this because this will fit in some of the apartment style residences like this would oh this would fit in one of the sesame street apartments this would fit in one of the apartments on the main street set that we're going to be getting uh this year the the christmas set that came out this year so it takes all kinds so i really like that we have a smaller one now that we'll be able to use. And I think, I really think this is going to go into Bert and Ernie's place once we're done with this. But for now, we set it here in the house. We set it on that red tree skirt. And you can see that the red base, let's bring it in closer. You can see that the red base kind of just blends in. I turn the light back on. Kind of just blends in with the tree skirt that they have down around the train. Oh, the train is a little crooked too. <laughs> So there we go. We got the tree and I'm glad we got the tree because like I said, a lot of these builds just really weren't vibing with me. wasn't really interesting to me. Like, and I, from some of the comments, I get the impression that you all kind of feel the same way this year too. That like what we got yesterday was, uh, the scarecrow was very much of a letdown there. Um, this little build, like, I still like this with the skates and the snowman. The birdhouse is kind of cool, but this thing that, like, we're not even really sure what it is, and definitely that with the rooster and the egg. There's just a lot this year that, um, it's kind of meh for a lot of it. But, like, I like the tree, I like Ray's and her little snowblower thing here. Can't, I, like I keep saying, I really want to get the, the final piece, the trailer that's supposed to hook on. Watch this thing has made a liar out of me and there's no trailer to hook onto. I was actually thinking this year of not getting the Lego City set and actually getting the Friends set, which I still may do next year because even though I don't have any Friends sets to put out to match up with it, some of the stuff that was in the Friends Advent calendar was really nice, really colorful, um, lots of golds, lots of reds, real real clever use of some of the pieces had very much a more stylized look than like the standard lego system does and they even had a gold like santa's throne set up for the friends kit or for the friends calendar and even though the dolls are a little bit bigger than the minifigures i still think there's a way that we could have i still think it would have been scaled that we could have used a lot of that stuff with the minifigs. So I'm actually thinking that next year, think, thinking about next year already, I'm actually thinking that next year we might get the Friends Advent Calendar just to take a look at that, see how that is, see how that plays out. Because um, I really do like the aesthetic of some of the stuff. I've just never picked up any of the sets. 
but that is next year and this year we have our tree so tomorrow on day 18 door number 18 where's it at let's scope it out now oh right here at the top i'm guessing another mini fig probably the last one before father christmas at 24 so whoops <laughs> so come back tomorrow let's see what we got so until then my friends merry christmas stay safe stay healthy and as always thank you for watching